hello my loves welcome back to my channel today i'm gonna be showing you guys how to make tacho soup those of you who are from the southwest you know tacho soup it is so delicious i remember when i was a kid we used to go to the village my dad was a soft chief then and the woman would prepare him tacho soup with lots and lots of meat i will never forget that it stuck in my memory and growing up we used to cook it so we buy it in the united states i decided to try it as well and it was perfect and i was like why not make a recipe put on youtube so you all can equally enjoy this soup. So guys, let's get started. The ingredients are right in front of me here. Here is one teaspoon of black pepper. If you have white pepper, so you could put one teaspoon or one tablespoon if you're a white pepper fan. And this is two teaspoons of organo. Here you have your one cup of tacho leaves. Here you have your three quarters cup of agusi. Here you have your one third cup of jangsa. We'll be using half of a bag of um, so that's um, sliced okra. You'll be using a, a teaspoon of salt, half seasoning cube in your red um, oil as well. So, guys, and our meat, by the way, our meat is over here cooking. You could add dry fish to eat whatever other um, particulars you enjoy. So, let's get started. So, first of all, in a skillet, I just put half a cup of water to boil while I blend my goosey. Okay, this is all blended up. Now we're gonna add one third cup of water and we're gonna stir it up. The reason I'm doing this is because I want my goosey to have lumps. I don't want it to be all scattered in the pot. So I'm gonna put it straight away in the hot water. So I'm putting it in just like that and I'm gonna let it cook for about five to ten minutes. And once the water dries up, I'm gonna take it out. So the water is now dry and our goosey is now whole. We're gonna take it out. And in the same pan, I'm going to put some of the meat water, the stock. So at this juncture, we're going to go ahead and put in our blended jangsa, our black pepper. And if you have white pepper, this is the point you put in your white pepper. And equally, your half of the seasoning cube. Smash them in. And now your tetra leaves going as well. Stir that up. And probably a one cooking spoon of red oil. This juncture, we're gonna mix our organo with a little bit of warm water, just like that. And then we're gonna cut up our meat and put in the soup, just like that. And we're gonna go in with our tap, on all with our organo and our okra, just like that. Spread it up properly. I'm gonna go in with my salt as well. And if you're a pepper lover, at this point you could put in your pepper. But if you're not, that's still okay. And some people put red oil together with vegetable oil or granola oil, they call it mixed. It's all up to you. But our soup is gradually coming together, as you can see. Looking yummy already. And the smell of the Tacholis is all over the house. It's so beautiful. It's so, I mean, <laughs> can't wait to eat it. So I'm gonna go in with our goosey now. At this point, you stir very carefully because of the goosey, but at this point, you don't have to. You just have to let it cook, let the okra cook, and the goosey to finish cooking. And we're all done. And I'll show you guys what it looks like. So, guys, our tacho soup is all done. It is so delicious. It's so yummy, guys. Everything tastes right on point, guys. If you enjoyed this video, why not? Don't forget to share with your friends. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Hit that little bell on the side. So every time I upload a new video, you'll be the first to know. And if you happen to try this recipe, please let me know how it turned out. Because I'm about to have me some with some Gary. <laughs> White Gary. So guys, enjoy. I'll see you all in my next video. Be great. Bye.